Hello, my friends. Giovanna Bronia here. Um, most people call me Jovi because it's shorter and it's easier to uh, keep in mind. So, as I uh, told you uh, last time, today uh, we speak about uh, motivation. It's day 10 for uh, treasures for um, online and network marketers. And I'm going to talk about motivation. And listen to that sentence. Isn't that great? If you know what you really want, there is always a way. This is, this is, this is, this is huge. I mean, this does exactly say, when you have a clear focus, when you know exactly what you want to reach, there is, there is a way you go ahead like, like a, an arrow. You must have in mind and be conscious about what you want to reach. And, um, and you have to learn to motivate yourself. And this business, it's quite uh, difficult. If you are an entrepreneur, you have to motivate yourself. You cannot wait and, and bother your sponsor all the time and hope that he gives you the hint to motivate yourself again because it's your job. You're not an employee. I don't know if this is the right um, pronunciation. Uh, I mean, I, you're not employed anymore, so you have to check out what you can do to improve your business, um, what you can do to improve yourself, what you can do to to get fun on, on what you do and to keep going ahead, find a way to uh, recharge your batteries when they are going down because there will be moments in life or in this business uh, where your batteries are down and you have to find out a way how you can recharge them again. Uh, if you, uh, you can do um, a meditation, you can do some sport, you can go for a walk, you can go for a power walk, you can read some good uh, uh, books or watching uh, um, YouTube videos, uh, motivational stuff, and this can bring you up again because you uh, you are responsible for yourself. It's your business, and you have got to motivate yourself again. So uh, if there, uh, if you really know what you want, there is always a way to get there. So figure out what your way is. So uh, the thought number two is the additional energy we use. We, with which we master challenges that gives us extraordinary success and happiness. Um, have you ever been at the point at the point where you thought, "Wow, that's a huge mountain. How am I going to deal with that? And how am I going to pass it or find some strategies to get over that uh, huge mass in front of you?" So. This is the additional energy you really have to invest because you cannot sit down, sit back and wait until the, the mountains go, 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 goes away. That's not going to happen. So you have to figure out how you can mobilize uh, some energy to get over that. And yes, uh, we will encounter challenges over and over in our life. And we just cannot wait until, or, or, or maybe uh, keep you back because of uh, of encounter the challenge, or to uh, yet yeah, how, how shall I say that? That's difficult. You cannot wait and and uh, keep on staying away from that challenge just because you are afraid of it, or you are afraid to fail, or uh, or that you make fun out of you. And or other make fun of or, or out of you better this way it's the right way I think um, so you cannot uh, wait and, and, and I mean you are spending your life doing nothing if you uh, try to avoid the challenges who comes uh, all the time on your on your way so you really have to focus and you really have to uh, try to find some additional energy because if you can go with the challenge if you can um, go through it 
and uh, um, how shall I say it? That's a difficult topic tonight. Huh? I'm so sorry. I'm looking, still looking for words. Uh, I tried. I, I I think I improved a little bit, but still, still uh, looking for words. So sorry. Um, as you may know, uh, English English is not my my first uh, language. It's my first languages are Italian and, and German, so I'm perfect in that. But anyway. Uh, the thing is, what I want to say, um, the additional energy, how do you, do you motivate yourself? Um, you know that uh, my sponsor, Dave Reinecker, speaks a lot about that. Um, you really have, there are two things what motivates you most. The one is the pleasure, the second one is pain. And pleasure doesn't work really, really good because when you have pleasure, then you have no... Uh, worrying um, um, uh, thoughts in, in your head so there is no no uh, nothing who pushes you to go ahead so pain is the thing what mo motivates motivates you most because uh, this hurts and you don't want to feel that anymore and so this pushes you to do something to change something because you don't want to feel that uh, hurt uh, that that uh, that Yes, that uh, hurt, that pain anymore. So, pain is something what motivates you most because um, you want to go out of the situation. If it's a painful situation, it's a, fin a financial thing, or it's a health issue, or, or whatever causes pain in your life, it's not. Uh, that's not a nice, uh, nice feeling at, at all. So you want to go out of this. And that's why we say, we always say pain motivates you because you, you want to get rid of that pain and you're doing and searching to do everything you can, every, everything what's possible to come out of that. So these are the two things. That, that's why I say focus on something because on something specific because that gives you the energy to, to really go through like an arrow. You have this goal in mind and you just don't look right don't look uh, left and you just go ahead so the third point only those who have a, a, a motive are motivated of course I mean um, if I uh, have wishes if I don't have if I don't have wishes uh, or don't have uh, dreams I mean what should I invest why should I invest uh, energy it's 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 easy like it is it's it's okay like it is I uh, don't have to do anything more it's comfortable and this word is the it's the worst uh, word at all comfortable it's nice when you have a nice um, living room where you are comfortable but remember if you get comfortable in your life that means you're really standing still. There is no growth anymore if you're comfortable. That's why we say always, and as an entrepreneur, you have to do so. So uh, you have to go out this comfort zone because you know exactly, um, as long as I, I'm here in my comfort zone, nothing will change. Nothing will change. You are not motivated to change anything, so why should I work that hard? But if you have something in mind, uh, these challenges comes. Do you have to cross that line? You have to cross the line. You have to go out of your comfort zone, and that makes you that makes you grow. It may hurt a little bit at the beginning, but you will feel that this is where growth uh, takes place. So leave your comfort zone, go out and try something new. <coughs> Excuse me. The first point is um, network marketing or online marketing are the best school for uh, for personal growth. I mean, there there is such so much uh, personal development in, inside that because you have to learn. Um, what is success? What does success mean for me? For 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 me, it could be to be a good uh, therapist, 
or for a mom, it could be to be a, a great mom to look after my ch properly after my children to, to give them everything they need. Or uh, you learn to manage your time, you have to schedule your, your time, you are not employed anymore, so you have the whole day for you, you have to schedule your time to get your things done. This is something you learn. You, you learn how comfortable it is to have your own money. You do not, uh, you, you do not depend on something else anymore. That's a great feeling. And you get, you learn to get self 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 determined, and uh, to to gain uh, uh, self esteem. You you get that feeling that you are really worthy because you're doing your job, you're doing your work, you're doing your hard work, and this will at the end lead somewhere. So be, uh, how shall I say? believe in that you have to believe in that you 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 have to know that you are good as you are you are doing it well do not stay there and uh, and and criticize yourself because we are the the worst criticizer <laughs> no one else uh, critiques you that much as we do ourselves so learn to accept you as you are and go uh, uh, take your time take your time take your uh, you have everybody has his own pace uh, take your time and you will get there because there is no way you are not going to be successful if you're doing your work every day and constantly and per, uh, with persistence this is what i wanted to say about motivation i hope i didn't do too uh, many mistakes i have i have to improve more and more i know but that's what i told you i'm i'm never satisfied you know i'm uh, I tr I'm always trying to better myself but that's that's not a wrong thing to do i mean um, this this is growth as well i'm exposing myself now <laughs> in those videos and it's still a hard thing to do because i mean if i could talk in german or in italian which i could of course and that would be um more easy to do so uh yeah i hope you understand me anyway <laughs> and uh, yes uh, um, and i leave you a good night here it's evening already in Europe and I wish you a nice a nice day, a nice morning, a nice evening and a good night wherever you are in the world. I hope you could uh, take out some value of this. Um, yes, leave me a comment. Let me know if this is something uh, you can use um, uh, for your life or yeah, any comment is uh, very much appreciated. Thank you so much. And I uh, see you in the next video, which is personal development. Okay, thank you very much for listening. Bye-bye. See you soon.